Buenas noches. Good evening. Good Good evening. Day. ¿Cómo están? ¿Todo bien? Fine, thank you. That's great. That's great. I'm fine. Vaya. Vamos a dar inicio. Sean bienvenidos. Recuerden que el día de mañana tenemos clase. ¿Ok? Para que eh, lo tomen en cuenta y hagan tiempo. Porque vamos a reponer la clase del día lunes. ¿Ok? Vaya. El día de ahora vamos a dar inicio con un tema nuevo. ¿Ok? Y el tema se llama Daily Routines o Rutinas Diarias. Daily Routines. Se lo voy a escribir aquí en el, en el chat. Sin embargo, quiero hacer un, uh, un pequeño de repaso de los temas que hemos visto. ¿Se recuerdan? Ok. So, I'm going to ask some questions to Julio. Julio, give me some affirmative sentences using the simple present. What are some affirmative sentences that you remember? Um, let me see. Um, uh -huh. For example. For example. Uh, oh, uh, how do you to get work? Um, okay. Oh. That's good. That's good. However, that's a question. We're going to move to the questions later on. But right now, what I want you to do is to give me affirmative sentences. So remember that we have affirmative sentences, negative sentences, and we also have um, questions. I yes. just need affirmative yes. sentences. Uh, uh, me agarró así. <laughs> uh, yes, yes, I do. I don't. I not, I don't. Ok, pero ahí me está dando la última información, que son la, las respuestas cortas. El sí, el no. Eso es lo que está diciendo usted. Sí y no. Yes. Necesito oraciones afirmativas usando el presente simple. Uh, ok, see. somebody else. Uh, Démosle la, la oportunidad a alguien más para que le ayude y luego usted participa. Vamos a ver si okay. alguien más tiene otras ideas. Ajá, Wilber, go ahead, please. Este, podrías, me recuerdo que hablábamos de I Go to World by Morosaco. Era una okay. afirmativa, algo así va. Exactly. Okay, yeah, that's, that can be one. I go to work by motorcycle. Nidia, give me another affirmative sentence using the simple present. Nidia Jamilez. I don't work. Okay, I don't work in an office. You can say that. Okay, thank you. Now, let's listen to uh, Jenny Jasmine. Affirmative sentence, please. Uh -huh. I, in the work, the house. I work in the house. Okay, excellent. Consuelo, affirmative sentence, please. ¿Se pueden apoyar con las imágenes que les mandé al, al grupo de WhatsApp? Todos están en el grupo de WhatsApp, ¿correcto? ¿Es correcto? ¿O hay alguien que no está en el grupo de WhatsApp? Yes. ¿Sí? ¿Todos están en el grupo de WhatsApp? ¿O hay alguien que no está en el grupo de WhatsApp? Yo. Perdón. 
Sí, estoy en el grupo. Ah, ok. Mandé el, el material de apoyo. Ahí se pueden apoyar con las oraciones. Eh, Ana, Ana Lizeth, Ana Gabriela, Ana Esmeralda, Rebeca Beatriz. Conecten la cámara. Si tiene algún inconveniente, háganmelo saber, por favor. Okay. La cámara es necesario que la mantengan encendida. Ok, Valeria. Eh, give me an affirmative sentence using the simple present. Uh -huh. Uh, Consuelo del Rosario, affirmative sentence, please, using the simple present. Uh -huh. I go to work uh, by bus. I go to work by bus. Ana Gabriela Alvarenga, affirmative sentence using the simple present, please. Yo no estuve en la primera clase y porque tuve un inconveniente, no, no comprendí casi mucho. Ok. Eh, it's ok. Julio, affirmative sentence using the simple present. Do you like coffee? Ok. Pero me sigue dando eh, ah. preguntas. Necesito oraciones afirmativas. Ah. afirmativas. Recuerde que tenemos afirmativas negativas y preguntas. Ya nos vamos a pasar las preguntas, pero ahorita solo quiero oraciones afirmativas. Ok. Um, I, well, uh, I need a work. I need to work. Or, or I need a job. Thank you. Ana Lizeth, oh. give me negative sentences using the simple present. Negative sentence. Ana Avalos. Negative sentence using the simple present. Okay. I, I not eat. Eat. Yeah. I don't eat. Mm -hmm. Wilbur, negative sentence using the okay. simple present. Mm -hmm. Wilbur? Hola. Negative sentence using the simple present. Um, I, I don't, I don't like coffee. I don't like coffee. Thank you. Nidia, Nary sentence using the simple present. You don't know work. You don't work. Ok. Thank you. Carla Azucena. Negative sentence using the simple present. Please. I don't like music. I don't like music. Ok. Thank you. Now, uh, we're going to ask questions using the simple present. Uh, Julio, do you like play? Do you like playing soccer? Yes, I like. Yes, I do. Yeah. Yes, yes, I do. Yes, I do. I like. And the negative? I like no, it. I don't. No, I don't. Okay, okay Julio, no, ask yes. a question. Ask a question to one of your classmates using the simple present, please. Okay. Who are you going to uh, select? I I like it 
I like eat hamburger. No. Lo que, le, no. lo que le digo es que le haga una pregunta a uno de sus compañeros ah. usando el presente simple. Tiene que seleccionar okay. un compañero y hacerle una pregunta. Entonces, ok. Eh, déjenme buscar uno. Ana Campos. Ok, Ana Campos. Yes. Uh -huh. oh, wow. <laughs> What's the question? Let me see. Um, you play, you play baseball? No, I don't baseball. Yeah. Um. <laughs> <laughs> Siempre estoy haciendo preguntas. No, no. Este. No sé cuántas. Cuántas que hay, hombre. Ah, eh. Ok, uh, me, me. Ok, Ana okay. is going to ask you a question. Ajá. Ana, go ahead. Ok. Eh, do, do you go in work last week? No. No estamos usando no. el pasado simple, estamos usando el presente. Ah, ok, ok, ok. Ajá. Do you, uh, do you dinner uh, today? Tampoco. No, pues, no. Uh, um, uh, dele, dele, ya se le va a ocurrir que nos hemos atrofiado. <risa> <risa> ok, do... No, oír, no, oír como se dice, teacher, oír o escuchar. Yeah. Listen to or hear. Ah, uh, ok. Do, do, do you listen of hear class? Do you listen to yes, the I... class? Es <laughs> Do you listen to the class? Yes, I, I leave, I, yes, I do. Thank you. Ok, Thank Ana. You. Select one classmate. Ask a question. Okay. Okay. Uh, uy, me sale. Ah, no. Uh, Carla Galea. Ajá. Uh -huh. Okay. Do you do you like do you like mm, chocolate? Do you like chocolate? Yes, I like. Yes, I do. Yes, I do. Thank you, Carla. Select one of your classmates. Ask a question. Mm. Okay. Eh, Ana Gabriela. Ajá. Eh, I like, I like to play. I like mm. you play. No, I am not. Mm, no. Nuevamente, haga la pregunta. I like to class. No. Do you like the do you like the class or do you like the English class? Repeat. Do you like the English class? Do you like the English class? Uh-huh. Anna. Mm, me preguntó que si me gustan las clases o oh, mm -hmm. oh. the English? Yes. yes, yes, I do. Thank you. Okay. Now, guys, let's move to the daily routines. Let me go ahead and share my computer's screen. Once you can see it, just let me know, please. Okay? Alrighty. There you go. Okay. Can you see the computer's screen? Yes, uh, I, can, uh, I see. Yes, I can see it. 
Okay, Julio, read the objective for today's lesson, please. Okay. By the end of this class, you will be able, uh, I don't know how, how do able. you say able. You will be able, able to. To for simply present question. Additionally, you will pr practice a conversation about daily routine, which illustrates how this topic is used in a real life setting. 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 Okay. Setting. Thank you. Okay. Now I want you to I want you to pay close attention to the next video. It says simple present questions and conversation. I get up at noon. Okay. Now let's see. I'm going to play the video and just let me know if you can listen to the video. All right. Okay. Thank Hi, you. Okay. In this class, you'll learn how to form simple present questions. Additionally, you'll practice a conversation about. Pueden escuchar. Yes, yes, I, I listen. Okay, pongan, pongan mute para que todos escuchemos correctamente. Daily routines, which illustrates how this topic is used in a real. Started by practice in a conversation, which illustrates how this topic is used. Let's listen and practice. Let's go to the park on Sunday. Okay, but let's go in the afternoon. I sleep late on weekends. What time do you get up on Sundays? At 10 o'clock. Oh, that's early. On Sundays, I get up at noon. Do you eat breakfast then? Sure, I have breakfast every day. Then let's meet at this restaurant at 1 o'clock. They serve breakfast all day. Which is heard a conversation in which lots of questions were asked and answered. I would like to explain how these questions are formed. Let me start by explaining the auxiliary verbs that are used when forming questions in the simple present. Do and does are the auxiliary verbs. As we start forming questions, you must also understand this rule. Do equals to I, you, we, and they. Does equals to he, she, and it. This means that we will use the auxiliary do whenever we use the pronouns I, you, we, and they. And we will use the auxiliary does whenever we use the pronouns he, she, and it. Having said this, let me write the formulas to form questions. For yes or no questions, do or does, plus subject, plus the verb, plus some kind of complement. For WH questions, WH word, plus do or does, plus a subject, plus a verb, plus some kind of complement. Now let's take a look at the simple present questions on your screen. Do you get up early? No, I get up late. Does he have lunch at noon? No, he eats lunch at one o'clock. Do they drive to work? Yes, they drive to work every day. What time do you get up? At 10 o'clock. What time does he have lunch? At 1 o'clock. When do they drive to work? Every day. On the left side of the chart, you can see yes or no questions. So if you recall the formula that I mentioned a minute ago, for yes or no questions, do or does, plus the subject, plus some kind of verb, plus a complement. Uh, we're going to take the first example. Do you get up early? Do is the auxiliary verb. You is the subject. Get up 
is the verb and early is the complement and of course we need to add a question mark at the end the next question does is the auxiliary verb he is the subject have is the verb lunch at noon is the complement of course we need to add a question mark at the end now let me show you WH questions once again if you recall the formula that I mentioned a minute ago for WH questions WH word plus do or does plus the subject plus some kind of verb plus some kind of complement uh, let me select the first question on the right side of the chart. What time do you get up? What time is the WH word? Do is the auxiliary verb. You is the subject. Get up is the verb. And let's just analyze one more example. What time does he have lunch? What time is the WH word? Does is the auxiliary. He is the subject. Have is the verb. Lunch is the complement. Now it's your turn to practice these concepts by making as many examples of your own as you possibly can. Focus on making questions and answers. Form okay, guys. Let me go ahead and send to you these two screenshots. This is the first one. You will be able to see it on the Teams chat. Okay. I'm sorry, on the Zoom's chat, and you will be able to see it on the WhatsApp chat. For those who don't have access to the Zoom's chat, you will be able to see it on WhatsApp. There you go. There you had a conversation. And now, then let me copy the formula that was being discussed on this a specific video. Okay. This is the formula to ask questions, WH questions. Okay, I'm going to copy that on the Zoom chat and also on WhatsApp's chat. about the routine of your family, friends, and co-workers. After you complete this task, share it in our discussion. Okay, can you see the uh, screenshot on the WhatsApp? Pueden ver la captura de pantalla que les envié en WhatsApp. Sí. Okay. I need two volunteers to practice the first conversation. What it says, conversation. Two volunteers, please. Uh huh. Yeah. I need two volunteers. Anna and Carla, go ahead, please. Thank you. The conversation. First, the conversation. Well, Anna, teacher. Um, Anna Lisset Avalos. Sí, en, en Zoom la pueden ver. 
Aquí lo estamos sí. viendo. ¿Empiezo yo? Yes, thank you. Let's go to the park on Sunday. Ok, but let's go in the afternoon. I sleep like a clicker. What time do you, do you get out on Sunday? At 10 o'clock. Oh, then, Harry, on Sunday I get, I get off. Uh, corríjame ahí, teacher, por favor. Uh -huh. On Sunday, I get up at noon. I get up at noon. Mm -hmm. I get up at noon. Do you eat breakfast then? Sure. I have breakfast every day. Then let's make a restaurant at a one o'clock. They serve. Breakfast all day. Ok, thank you. Uh, Flor de María Montalvo. And a second volunteer. I need a second volunteer. Vaya, los que ya participaron pueden poner en mute el micrófono. Ok, Consuelo en Flor de María. Yes. Let's go to the park on Sunday. Okay, but let's go in the afternoon. I sleep late on with him. What time do you have up on Sunday? At 10 o'clock. Oh, that early. On Sunday, I had put a no. Do you eat a breakfast thing? I have breakfast every day. Uh, then let's meet at this restaurant at one o'clock. They serve breakfast all day. Okay. Thank you. Uh, let's see. Jenny and another volunteer. Jenny Jasmine, who wants to talk to Jenny Jasmine? Volunteers. Okay, Jenny and Ana Gabriela. Thank you. Okay, I'm going to you. Let's go to the park on the Sunday. Okay, but let's go. Go in the afternoon. What time do you get um on the Sunday? After of club. Oh, that's that's early. On the Sunday I get up at noon. Do you do you have breakfast then? Sure. I have breakfast every day. Then let me in this restaurant at home club. They serve breakfast all day. Okay. Thank you. Now, uh, look at the second picture related to the structure of asking questions. We're going to see it we're going to use it later. Let me go ahead and share my computer screen one more time. Once you can see it, just let me know, please. Can you see it or not yet? Guys, can you see it? Yes, I can see yes, it. I can see. Okay, thank you. Now, 
to ask the first one, this were the affirmative, negative, and questions for yes, no questions, okay? These were yes, no questions in the simple present, okay? For example, do you work? If I ask you, if I ask you, do you work? Your question, I mean, your answer will be, yes, I do, or no, I don't, correct? Is that correct? Yes, yes. Okay. However, beside the uh, just no questions, we have information questions. But in order to know the information questions, you need to know some WH words. WH words are uh, used in order to ask information questions. For example, you use when to ask about time. You use why to ask about reason. You use which to ask about choices. You use whom to ask about people. You use what to ask for information. You use where to ask about places. You use whose to ask about possession. You use who to ask about people and you use how to ask about processes or manners, if you want to say. Okay, so let me go ahead and uh, continue with the next slide. For example, if I ask you, let's see. If I ask you, what time do you go to work? Julio, what will be your answer? What time do you go to work? Uh, it's uh, eight o'clock. I, I go to work at eight o'clock. Okay, <laughs> thank you. If you see, I use what? in that question. So, what time do you go to work? Okay. okay. Let's see. Um, I would like to ask somebody else. Let me go ahead and select somebody else here. All right. Anna Lisseth, question for you. When do you visit your family? When do you visit your family? I would, would want to visit my family and at weekend. On weekends. On okay. Weekends. Jan, uh, Jenny Jasmine, why do you like English? Or why do you study English? Jenny, yes. Yes. why do you study English? Wilbur, why do you study English? Mm, how my question, teacher? Aha. Uh -huh. um, Por qué estudias inglés? Why do you study English? Me, digamos, no podría decirlo en español. <laughs> no. Estamos, estamos estudiando inglés, chicos. No podemos enfocarnos en español. No, pero es que eso me cuesta bastante la... Uh, como expresarme. 
tratemos de, aunque nos equivoquemos, no importa, pero tratemos de hacerlo en inglés. Ok. Mm. Ok. So, why do you study English? Valeria, do you study English to have a better job? Do you study English to go to other country? Why do you study English? I'm sorry? Vuelva a preguntar, por favor, no le escuché. Why do you study English? Que me gusta estudiar inglés, ¿eh? ¿verdad? ¿Por qué estudias inglés? Eh, y, um, para, um, y, ¿Cómo se dice buscar en inglés? To find. To look y, for. Y to find my work. Ok. Como, no sé si me entendió. Okay, to find a better job. Okay, Ajá, you can say yeah. that. Mm -hmm. Ana Hay Campos, which color, thank you. Which color do you prefer? Do you prefer red color or black color? Uh, I like color black. Okay, I prefer black color. Okay. Thank okay. you. Um, what time do you eat your dinner? Consuelo, what time do you eat your dinner? Consuelo? It is. It is what time do you eat your dinner? Okay. I eat it at 10 o'clock. Thank you. Ten o'clock. Okay. Erika Johanna, where do you work? Where do you work? Uh -huh. Where do you work? Ajá. Where do you work? Julio, where do you work? I work. Uh, I don't work. I am retired. Oh, you are retired. Good for you. Uh, Ana Esmeralda. Who is your favorite actor? Okay. And who do you talk? Who do you talk with every morning? Who do you talk with every morning? Uh-huh. Who do you talk with every morning? ¿Con quién hablas todas las mañanas? Uh, my mother. I talk with my mother. Yes. Okay. How do you like chocolate, Consuelo? Do you like uh, cold or hot? How do you like chocolate? Cold or hot? 
um, cold. Okay. I like cold chocolate. I like cold chocolate. Mm -hmm. Okay. There you will be able to see some questions on the WhatsApp group. Ahí hay unas preguntas. Revísenlas. Creo que sí se ve si sí, hacen amplia la imagen. The question number two. Wilbur, uh, where do you live? Can you see the can you see the questions on the WhatsApp group? I like yeah. um, Anna, where do you live? I live in Santa Ana. In Santa Ana. Okay, Anna. Yes. Choose one question and select one of your classmates. Okay. Ask the, ask the question number three. Okay. Question number three. Uh, okay. What? Kind of movie do you like? What kinds of movies do you like? Excellent question. Mm -hmm. I like. Mm -hmm. um, it seems, uh, uh, tipo de. ¿Qué tipo de, de, de películas película. te gustan? Uh -huh. Ok. Aquí. ¿Cómo sería chistoso? ¿Funny? Ok. You can say, I like comedy okay. movies. Ok. I like um, King Lion. Okay. Uh, Julio, select one classmate. Ask the question number, let's see, the number four. Okay. Uh, let me see. Uh, Carla Susana. Uh huh. How, how often do you? do exercise how often do you do exercises i do exercise okay there you have other examples i'm going to ask the question to to uh, let's see anna esmeralda do you like coffee yes do you like coffee do you like coffee ¿Cómo se responde cuando es una, una respuesta afirmativa, chicos? Yes, I do. Yes, okay, I, yes do. I do. Coffee. No, yes, I do coffee, no. Yes, no. I do. Yes, yes, I like coffee. Do you like coffee? Yes, I do. Ok. Consuelo del Rosario. Number two. What do you usually eat for breakfast? Mm. Usually eat for breakfast, um, mm -hmm. egg, um, mm -hmm. um, banana. Okay. Thank you. How often do you do exercises, Nidia? How often do you do exercises? I exercise it, um, usually in the six o'clock. I usually do exercises at six o'clock. Annalise, Seth, do you have any pets? Do you um, have pets? Teacher, I have a question. Mm -hmm. How do you say pets? Huh? How do you say pets? Pets? Mm -hmm. 
Ok, me estás preguntando cómo sí, dices el... pets y ajá, yo te digo ajá. pets. Ajá, ajá. O oh, quieres saber qué significa pets. Ah, ok. Pets, animals, your dog, your cat. Uh -huh, okay. Mm -hmm. Do you have any pets? Uh, yes, I do. Yes, I do. Excellent. Uh, dog. ¿Cómo se le llaman esos pequeñitos que? Chihuahua. Chihuahua. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Okay. Uh, Valeria, what time do you usually wake up? What time do you wake up in the morning? Aha. Uh -huh. Ana Gabriela, yes. I five in morning. I wake up at five in the morning. Excellent. Ana, what's your favorite TV show? What's your favorite TV show? It's cualquiera. Mm -hmm. it, it is. Pero lo, lo digo en inglés o. En inglés, English. No, la, el, la televisión, este programa. Si es en inglés, en inglés. Si es en español, tiene su nombre propio en español. It is. Mm. Mickey Mouse. Okay, thank you. Wilbur, do you enjoy reading books? Do um, you enjoy reading books? Well, that's in, in toda la pregunta. Uh -huh. <laughs> What's the meaning? Ah, yes, Disfrutarle. Disfrutas le, leer eh, libros? Mm. So, so, so. <laughs> yes, I do. Or uh, no, yes, I, I don't. Ah, uh, okay. Uh, yeah, tengo problemas con eso. Tengo problemas con eso. No, repeat. Yes, I do. Or no, I don't. Yes, I do. Or no, I not. Or, or no, I don't. Okay. Entonces, ¿disfrutas o no disfrutas? No, I don't. Okay, no, I don't. Excellent. Ana Lizeth Avalos, how often do you usually get to work or a school? How often, I'm sorry, how do you usually get to work or a school? Do you go by car, by bus? How? Sorry. I... <laughs> I go, I go, I work, uh, I'm my bus. I go to work by bus. Uh, yes. Okay. Nidia, Jamilez, what do you like to do in your free time? What do you like to do in your free time? Uh-huh. I do like, um... My free time mm -hmm. playing. Okay, I like playing. What do you play? Do you play video games? Do you play soccer? What do you play? I'm uh, playing the football. Okay, thank you. Now you have some time expressions, guys, that you need to take into consideration by using the simple, uh, simple present. You have every day, every week, every month, every year, daily, weekly, monthly, and annually. I'm going to send you a picture. Porque creo que las capturas no les están cargando. Les voy a mandar mejor una, una foto. Va a ser más fácil. Ok. There you have a picture. Ya la pueden ver en WhatsApp. 
Yes. Okay. Yes. Awesome. There you had the uh, present time expressions and let's move forward. Okay, let me do something. I'm going to switch this one, okay? And I'm going to show it right now. There you have, there you have the daily routine. If you see, this one, it says, I get up, right? I'm sorry, I wake up. I wake up. This one, I get up. Then I take a shower. After that, I get dressed. Later, I comb my hair. Here, I have breakfast. I go to work. I start working or I start work. I answer emails. I have lunch. After lunch, I finish work or I finish working. Then I arrive home. After that, I feed the dog. Later, I cook dinner. After that, okay, I have dinner. Later, I watch TV. After watching TV, I go to bed. And at the end, I fall asleep. Is that clear? Yes. Is yes. that information clear? Yes. Okay. Yes. Let me go ahead and send you a picture as well. Okay, for you to have it on your notes. Just give me some seconds. Teacher. Yep. I, I have a question. Mm -hmm. No puede traducir. Vaya, fíjense que sí lo puedo hacer. Pero por eso, le, por eso traje las imágenes. Y fíjense que... Vaya, por ejemplo, en la, en la imagen número uno. ¿Qué creen que está haciendo esta persona? Según la levantando, imagen. Levantando. Levantándose. Despertando. Despertándose, ¿correcto? Ah, despertando. ¿Qué creen que está haciendo la, la segunda imagen? I get up. Levantándose. Levantándose. ¿Qué está, ¿Qué está haciendo la siguiente imagen? I take a shower. Bañándose. Me ducho, ¿verdad? Sí. ¿Y qué creen que está haciendo la siguiente imagen? Arreglando su ropa. Arreglándose, vistiéndose. Sí. ¿Ok? ¿Qué está haciendo la siguiente imagen? I comb my hair. Arreglándose. Y acá estas dos personas que están haciendo. I have breakfast. Tomando su desayuno. Ok, tomando el desayuno, comiendo el desayuno. Y estos que están haciendo. I go to work. Van para el trabajo. Van para el trabajo. Entonces con las imágenes quiere decir que sí se entiende. El problema de, de ir traduciendo todos. Y créanme de que yo los entiendo porque yo fui alumno también. Pero si no se les habla inglés, no se van a acostumbrar. Entonces, mi responsabilidad es traerles material así como este, donde ustedes puedan fácilmente identificar todo, pero no se puede ir traduciendo todo en español. Tienen que irse acostumbrando y cambiarse el chip de que estamos aprendiendo inglés. ¿Ok? Ok. Yo sé que, yo sé que cuesta al principio porque yo fui alumno, pero si nunca se nos habla en inglés, nunca nos adaptamos. I don't know, 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 I
Ah, you don't know, you don't know how to read. Uh -huh. Okay. Uh, we're going to practice later on, okay? Now, there you also have, let me go ahead and share the platform because on the platform, you are going to work alone. Let me just check something. We have five minutes to complete an exercise online. Give me one minute. Okay, it says, knowledge check, instructions, and scramble the questions to complete, and scramble the questions to complete the conversation. Write the questions in the blank. This time, you don't need to type a question mark at the end. Okay? So, here, let's see, it says, example, do you exercise every day? Yes, I exercise every day, okay? The next one, here. Let me see. Okay, uh, complete the, the number two, Julio. Uh, let me see. What do you do? No. Yes. What do you do? What what time do you do lunch eat? What time do you eat lunch? Eat. Ah. What time? Tiene que poner la oración en orden. Do you eat lunch? Lunch. Okay. Next. Okay. Another volunteer. I me. Mean? Mm -hmm. uh, number two. Uh huh. Number three. It is difficult. <laughs> do do a time class start. Eight A. Das. Das. Uh huh. Class. This class. Class start. Start. Eight. At eight o'clock. Mm -hmm. Eight o'clock. Okay. Next. Another volunteer. When do you study English? When do you study English? Okay. And the last one. Es que es complicada. No, no sé cómo armarla. Do you? Do you? Do you? Play sports. Do you, uh -huh, do you and your friends? And your friend, mm -hmm, and your friend play a sport on weekends. Play a sport on, on weekend. weekends. Excellent. On weekends. Vale, veamos la respuesta correcta. Vamos a ver a dónde se... Nos equivocamos. Does this class start at eight? Ah, uh, no, at nine. Let's see. Does this class start at eight o'clock? Pero si eso es lo que dice. At eight o'clock. Solo por la coma, quizás. Vamos a ver. Sí, eso suele suceder. Vamos a ver aquí. Hmm. Sí, solo por la coma, pero la, la respuesta está correcta. Does this class start at 8 o'clock? 
Oh, el punto. Vamos a ver. No, siempre da el error. Pero es el, esa, esa comita es la que está fallando. Sí, bueno, así sucede a veces que no, a veces tú no crees que tiene la respuesta correcta y no se la, no se la pone correcta. Vaya. Entonces, eh, es, es, es la comita en línea. Nos vamos a quedar hasta acá. Ya son las 8. Espero continuar el día de mañana. Recuerden que el día de mañana hay clases. El material de refuerzo se los envié al WhatsApp. ¿Ok? No les quito más de su tiempo. Si no han cenado, buen provecho. And see you tomorrow. Good see night. you tomorrow. See you tomorrow. Good night. Good night. Bye. Good night. Bye. Bye. Bye.